happy Father's Day to all the dads out there, including my own. Because, not to brag, but I kind of have the best one. Sorry, guys. I'm making me another little OS bubble boba tea. This one, taro flavored. I got my ice in my little cup. I've got my milk. I also added fruit this time. I've got a uh, dragon fruit, mango, and banana chunk blend that I, I think will just pair really well with this taro flavor because taro, I like to call it the unicorn drink because it's like sweet. It's a gorgeous purpley color and its flavor is just unique. You know, it's not vanilla. It's not coconut. It's kind of like a sugar cookie birthday cake, fruit, blueberry fruitness slightly. I don't know. It's just good. I just know. It's just good people. Mm. And I swear our American, look at this. Look at this. Our American sweet potato just tastes nothing like this. Hold on. My daddy was calling me. He lives right across the street, which is one of the reasons why I love my house so much. Because my family is literally next door. Well, not literally. There's a good quarter acre or so in between our houses. But he's number four, and I'm number five. And I got blue ink on my hands. I was um, decorating a grave marker for my daughter's pet. We lost our dear Sassy yesterday in the wee wee hours in the morning yeah mm. Mm -hmm. Mm. that is good that is good another success story of another yummy delicious bubble boba beverage I did a uh, float brown sugar float the other day fabulous and now i did like this fruity one with taro so good mm. and the the lovely purple pinks and orangey red in there and the mango is just gorgeous and the flavors just work they just work mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so yeah I get mine in the freezer section, but you know, you don't have to be limited to OS bubble tea. This Jay's basket makes a really cool one. They're like, don't they look like cartoon thingies, anime, whatever. But yeah, so it comes with the brown sugar boba. And then this is black tea flavored, so it comes with the, the powder. Which is standard. Oh, and then you get straws in it. So I found this kit. I want to say... I want to say I got it at Walmart. Honest. I was in a different town. And we found a, like a Walmart grocery store. And we didn't realize it was Walmart grocery store. Didn't realize that's what a Walmart market is. It's groceries only. Kind of pricey. I think I paid $7.99 also for this, and it's only three. Like Grocery Outlet, I got, I think it was a 12 pack, because it had three flavors, matcha, brown sugar, and taro, and I believe there was three or four packets each flavor, plus the straws. And then this is like an all-in-one, so it's got the syrup and the boba mixed in, versus having the packet and the boba. This boba is incredibly soft very very fat very soft boba it's very good though mm. let's see microwave okay all the bobas you're gonna microwave right this one says microwave it 45 seconds from frozen i did it thawed and i did it like 25 seconds and the boba wasn't as soft it wasn't like like a gummy it was more rubbery so a longer time gives you softer boba. My like the dry packet ones, they usually say to cook the boba anywhere from like 15 to 17 seconds usually. Um, this one says 45 seconds, but it has you cook the, the tea powder with the boba. So it's the same deal, you know. But yeah, if you go at least 45 seconds, you're gonna have nice, nice boba. 
Mm. I like the frozen fruit in it. I really do. Kind of makes me wonder. Blended up. Blended. Blend the fruit. Blend the milk. Or whatever liquid you use. In the ice. And then add the boba last. It would kind of be like a flow or a milkshake, huh? Oh, yeah. I can see us doing that one. Maybe with the matcha. Because I don't know about you, but has anyone noticed how matcha is really grassy tasting? Or is it just me? The OS bubble, though. When I made the matcha flavor and I made it with vanilla ice cream, it was to die for. It tastes like, like you know, the $7 boba drinks that you get at the little cafes or whatever tea stands you get them at. So, yeah. Now I'm wondering what kind of fruit can I mix with matcha <laughs> that will pair well and override that grassy taste? Mm. I wonder what taro and matcha would taste like. Mm. Any thoughts, people? Mm -hmm. Happy Father's Day.